Welcome back. This is Mr. Tipton, and today we are talking about percent error. Percent error is the difference between an estimate, a prediction, or a measurement, and the actual value. Sometimes people make a guess at something, or they measure something incorrectly. Um, to find the percent error means you, you take the error, and the difference in what you thought it was and what it actually is, and you divide it, by the actual value and then multiply by a hundred to turn a decimal into a percent. Okay, Percent error is the amount of error divided by the actual value times a hundred. Let's look at some. Example number one. Looks like Alyssa estimates that her school gym has 660 seats. That should have an S on it, shouldn't it? Seats. But it actually has 750. What is the percent error? All right. Uh, percent change. That should not say percent change. It should say percent error is what we're talking about. The error. All right. So she thought it had, she guessed, she estimated that it had 660, but it actually has 750. All right. So the difference between those six. 60 from 750 is 90. Her error, she was off by 90. Divided by the actual amount, which was 750. 90 divided by 750, just throw it in the calculator and you get 0 0.12. But we need to multiply that by 100 because we are looking for a percent. So Alyssa was off by 12%. She had a 12% error. Her, her guess uh, subtracted from the actual, divided by the actual. Let's look at another. Um, looks like somebody was guessing how much, some, how much something weighed. The estimated weight was 8 pounds. The actual weight of it was 6.4 pounds. So what were we off by? The error was 8 minus 6.4, which is 1.6. So the error, 1.6, divided by the actual weight, which was 6.4. 1.6 divided by 6.4 is equal to 0 0.25 times 100. There is a there was a 25% error. One more. Measure length and an actual length. Somebody measured, used their ruler or something, and found that it was 2.5 centimeters. The actual length was 2.54 centimeters. So they weren't off by much. They probably just rounded is what they did, but they, they weren't off by a whole lot. The difference between the two, the error, how much were they off by? Well, 2.54 minus 2.5 is only 0 0.04 off. So the error is very small, 0 0.04 divided by the actual length, 2.54. If you put that in the calculator, you get 0 0.016 times 100 moves the decimal twice, which means the error was only 1.6%. That's not too bad. That's a very, very small percent error. Okay, that's pretty much it. Percent error. You take the error divided by the actual amount, multiply it by 100 to make it a percent, and there you go. If you have questions, write them down, and we will see you soon.